tensions escalate on the southwest side as the city gets closer to housing at least 2,000 migrants at a base camp in Brighton Park. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Scott Schneider. And I'm Don Hasbrook. That encampment is slated for a vacant lot at 38th in California, but a meeting tonight grew heated when residents divided on the plan. Casey Cronus is live from Kelly High School with the latest. Casey. Hey, Don and Scott. Well, residents say they only found out about the plan when they saw construction crews working at the site. Tonight, they were calling for transparency, but it's something many of them feel they didn't get when the meeting reached capacity and they weren't allowed in. We could even hear the pounding on the doors from inside. A line down the block shows just how much residents wanted in on the conversation. <laughs> But a full auditorium meant the crowd stuck outside, never got a seat at the table. Located at 38th in California, crews have already started making way for new arrivals. The city still needs to finish environmental testing, but says the site is suitable for prefabricated camp structures. They'll be built by Garda World Federal Services. The encampment will have heating and air conditioning, laundry services, a mobile kitchen trailer, and makeshift restrooms and showers. And I want to stress that these shelters are temporary. We are not intending, the city of Chicago does not intend to have shelters that are open for years and years. A meeting on the matter brought mixed reaction, with some calling for better living conditions for migrant families. Because I don't want any of my neighbors to have to live on the streets or in tents. Others say they're concerned over safety and don't want the encampment in their neighborhood. We have concern about our students, our children, who walk on this street every day. How do we ensure their safety? Now, officials have not yet announced a move-in date. They do say this campsite will mainly be for families, and once the build starts, they say it could be ready in a matter of days. Reporting live in Brighton Park, Casey Cronus, Fox 32, Chicago.